Hey everyone, this is Manly Badass Zero, and welcome to Stitched. Stitch is an RPG Maker horror game about a girl who wakes up in a twisted doll factory. The more you seek the light of hope, the further you will stray into the dark abyss. Anxious return home, a young college student aboarded the train wondering what the future has in store for her. Yes. And this future sucks. She never made it. I guess that's why she's stitched. Where am I? What is this place? My body. Why does it feel so stiff? No! My hands! Ah! This can't be. What happened to me? <gasps> You're on the wrong side of a Nightmare Before Christmas cosplay. My face. What is going on? Movement. Item hotkey, that's new. Cancel back main menu, interact, or action. New objective. Survive. Objective is to spin on top left. Where am I? Should I search the room for clues to my current whereabouts? Birthday, June 25th, height 501. See, college student, an 18 year old girl with a sweet and honest personality. She was diagnosed with a serious heart condition at a young age. Her symptoms will worsen whenever she is frightened. Let's see, this can potentially lead to her passing out or worse, death. So, right now we're at 20% fright. This is pulled from a certain game. It's very famous, but I forgot it for some reason. I always mix it up with another game that's a very similar name. Uh, help manual, sensual. Not now. The purple text represents Catherine's spoken dialogue. The blue text encapsulated in parentheses represents Catherine's thoughts. Actually, a few games have like, put in a fear meter. Like, Ill Bleed is one where you literally die from fear, possibly. Now, how do I... Open my inventory. Alright, let's investigate the room and hopefully not get spooked. Oh, we just got spooked. Is that blood? Uh, the note is covered in so much blood. Stay here, do not leave this room. Everything outside will be much too much for you to handle. Hmm. That's all I can read. Now I'm curious to see what's outside. Oh? Electric lantern. So now I think I'm hmm. assuming we have light? Hmm, it's missing a battery. What's this? Is that a battery? No, it's just a light. It's over here. A couple of batteries. Sweet. I wonder. Ah. Do we have to manage batteries, or is this just... Bingo. I'm assuming we don't. Okay. Nothing of interest in these drawers. I wonder if there's secrets. Like... Maybe there's hidden items that are outside of the bounds of the little shinies we see. Though the text is legible. Just a bunch of books. <laughs> a cute teddy bear. A pity will be burned to carry. A strange statue. It reminds me of Mother. Flashback. Catherine! You had me so worried. Don't go running off like that again, sweetie. But mommy, I'm scared. There, there, it's all right. Mommy's here. Well, that's a stereotypical child memory. Kevin must interact with the statue to save the game. 
All right. Huh? We seeing a memory, or are we getting? Dr. Stark Holmes, the test results for your daughter came in yesterday. It seems she has a rather unusual heart condition. It will start beating irregularly whenever she is frightened. There's no known cure, and it could be fatal. Doctor, is there anything I can do for her? Please be calm, Mr. Stark Holmes. Give her these pills. They will help elevate the symptom. Do I have pills now to lower my fear? Hmm. These pills look just like my heart medication. Hmm. I'll swallow it just to see how the mechanic works. Phew, much better. These will be useful to have. Few stability pills. So Q is stability pills. Just a heart and I die from a heart attack, which I kind of figured anyway. So I'll go back and I'll hit the save point once again. And let's get out of here. The door is so large. Wait. It's unlocked. Head out. Huh? Prisoner room one. <gasps> what? Why am I in prison? New objective. Why am I in prison? I don't feel safe here. I need to find a way out. I kind of figured that one. I mean, I figured, like, you're in prison, your objective is escape. But, you know, they could have mixed it up, maybe gave him an objective. Get a donut. Blood. 4%. Blood. What's happened here? I should find something to cover the blood stain. Do you really need to find something to cover the blood stain? Oh, man. I see where this is going. So do we want the sheets, which might have a corpse under it? Or do we want the towel that will most likely be safe? Let's go for the sheets! This make blankets cover the bed. Take the blanket. Oh no, it's fine. Huh. I was a little surprised. What was there... Was that an important decision? It's like I come back to haunt me? Okay. Well, that's that. Um... I see Nemesis is wandering around. Looks more like Tyrant, though. Same species. What in the world was that? I can't stay here. I need to find a way out. Blah! Got fear. I stepped on blood, I'm scared. I need to find a way to get across. Maybe a plank will do the trick. Oh boy, I gotta find some planks. D. Oh no, they actually are letters, not Roman numerals. So that was I, and that was D. What we got here? The medicine balls are empty. What's this written on the label? All I can read is anabolic androgenic? Huh? More blood. Oh, wait, no, it's worse. Ooh, that jumped our fear up a lot. This can't be happening. Oh god, I'm reminded of eternal darkness. This can't be happening. You need to get some sunglasses so you can, like, cover the body. Name Michael Bansley, age 19, prisoner ID 3920. Once a class president, now a prison resident. Tough luck. Don't step in the blood. That triggers our fear. The text is another language. I can't read any of it. What's this? A wooden table. It seems light for its size. Hmm. A hole behind the table. Okay. I kind of want to get this loot that's over here, though, where the shinies are. But we can't. So that's that. Huh? 
No great more blood. A symbol on the floor. It looks like a flower. No, that's probably chaos. Criminals, thieves, crooks, they all deserve to die. Every single one of them. I'm gonna take a pill just to be safe. Why are these cute bunny bun bun? You're in the cell. Name Henley Mason, age 28, prisoner ID 2402. From the outfit, I'm guessing this woman used to be a police officer. Memory of Sophia Mason. Oh? Oh? Oh my. Many times I wish I could turn back time and pull the trigger. I would give anything to see you again, my dear sister. Any corpses around here? Page 42. Yesterday, a man pleaded to me for his life, claiming what he did was just petty theft. I had no choice. I need to feed my children, he said. After some contemplation, I decided that a few rounds of his head shouldn't teach him never to steal again. Hoo-hoo-wee. A different pill. I wonder what it's for. Speed pill? Oh man, if we want to go fast. Quite literally. It's not reference. The only way to deliver absolute justice is to purge the guilty. Mercy is but a hindrance. Now let's get out of here. <gasps> oh shoot, the battery! Wait. I still have a battery left. <laughs> oh boy! Those bunnies, they weren't there before. <gasps> Why me? Why does this have to happen to me? It's because I said bun bun, didn't I? Another statue resembles Mummer. How many of these are in here? So, let's see what's up here. I'm honestly a little confused where I should go first, because case is locked. Okay. I need to, like, get my bearings. Oh. Like, I gotta figure out what's the right path Great. here. I'm out of the facility. I can use to navigate my way out. Maybe this was the right way first. Oh, so we're, we're in the prison, which we already knew. Uh, okay, there's a West Wing. Wait. This is not going to help me in my locales at all. Wait a minute. Stockholm's private research. I don't understand. It's his father's doll factory. Catherine can closely observe certain items by selecting them in her inventory. Hmm. It's not too helpful immediately, though. Let's see, if power usage is at 100%, automatic lock system for security gate and A and B will be disabled. Let's see, you want me to go and start flipping on all the TVs? Because I'll do that. Here, won't turn on. Trash can is empty, like my soul. Avoid that. I returned from lunch break and saw what was left of my co workers. Bodies on the floor. This is too much. Who in the world could have done such a thing? Maybe this is my imagination. Maybe I'm working too hard. Whatever it is, I can't bring myself to believe that any of this is real. Monitor A, power supply, current power usage is 0%. Let me think. So we gotta figure out the fractions here, I'm assuming. We already read this, okay. So here we have 12, 29, 32, 44 percent. Four. So they put that four percent there to taunt you, like, oh, you think you can just do 95 percent on the one computer, then five? Eh, <laughs> I ain't happening, buddy. Well, let's just start picking. Actually, no, there's something in the back I gotta investigate. Shows you paramount power being consumed. Okay. So let's just pick a number. I mean, I could do this smart thing and, like, write everything down and, like, add them all up and stuff like that. But I'm just gonna wing it. So let's pick a nice... a nice number. Let's... let's pick 50%. And 
and let's come back to you later, because you're a smaller fraction. Bump to 20, 75%. So a good 25 would do it. I don't think this is going to work. Eighty-seven. Yeah, we're just gonna be a little bit short. As you know, I got it exactly. Ah. Okay, I was one. I uh, was one number off of my head. I thought I did the math right initially, but I was like, well, "Am I right?" Yeah, that's what you get when you second guess yourself. Well, my life is just going swell. As it can be, considering the situation. So much loot and still, oh God, what was that? You're fine. Just wine. Oh. I have a symbol. This one resembles a heart. Hmm. Thousand Women's Diary, page one. It was an accident. Why won't anyone believe me? I would never purposely injure anyone, let alone a close friend. Just a bunch of papers. Huh? What's this? Yeah, we're taking this page. I don't know what it's for, but we're taking it. Diary page triple. I was framed! I know it! These actions, they can't possibly be mine. I don't remember anything. I don't remember. I just don't. So I must be innocent. Yeah, okay, Mr. Jekyll and Hyde. A poster of the play The White Roses. Alice Whitman is a star of this play. A play where she shot and killed a fellow actor in front of 2,000 audiences. You got a little too into your method acting there. No, it's a mental illness, personality disorder. Mental instability conditions such as personality disorder can sometimes lead to a homicidal ideation. It is advised that individuals diagnosed with this condition undergo rehabilitation as soon as possible. Diary page two. The murder wasn't my fault. Etc. Etc. Someone must have tipped this ball over. I think it was a killer doll. I swear I saw something pop out of that hole. Ooh, some stability pills. I gotta remember, pills don't show up as shiny, so if I do- Oh! Spot them. Uh, I gotta make sure to grab them. It's locked. Okay. So you only have a room. Bunch. So there was only over one or other room we could have gone. Okay. So let's go for the security gate. Let's not step in any blood because we freak out apparently. A long wooden board looks quite sturdy. What is this? Spooked! That was terrifying. No! Not that way! Yeah, we're definitely gonna need to take those pills. Then we gotta go back. The bunnies are gone! What are you so scared about? You should be happy they're gone. Oh? Watch out, I don't step on anything. Ooh, yeah, I almost stepped into that. I'm gonna get to that stuff over there. That body's there and it scares me. Should we use the map? The electric lantern? Or the wooden board? Let's go with the map. This wooden board should make a decent bridge. 
an old diary. Philip is a good boy. Philip does what mommy tells him to. Bringing friends home to play with and punishing them with mommy's knife if they are naughty. Naughty. How disturbing. Maybe that's the thing that's wandering around. Hmm. It's strange there's nobody around. <laughs> yeah, that's what you get. Gosh. Swoosh right in. A list of prisoners and their holding cells. Philip is in room A. Alice room B. Elizabeth room C. Michael Bancy room D. Bradford Turner room E. Charlotte Lawrence. Haley Mason. It's Chambers. My name is not on here. That's reassuring. Hopefully it's not a trap. Oh? Was that a spade? I never said this one looks like a fruit. How can you treat us like this? My sister and I have served you tirelessly these past eight years. What did we do to deserve this fate? Are we nothing more than properties in your eyes? Yes. Now get in the prison cell. I wish to be alone when I count my money. Page ten. She promised to protest where she is. Where is she now? Page eleven. I trusted her. She said she was willing to sacrifice everything for us. Yet why are we the ones to be sacrificed? Charlotte Lawrence, age thirty, prisoner ID one six two zero. Charlotte, that's an elegant name. What was that? What was that? Oh? A spool of thread, very useful for sewing. Bad food. Man, we're gonna be like chugging a lot of pills here at this rate. Oh? Oh. To unlock the gate leading downstairs, please carefully review the color combinations. Green, purple, orange. Hey, daily dose. White. <laughs> Total saves five. I feel like that's gonna come back to haunt me. Never spool. Smell of alcohol is unbearable. Spade plus spade. I think that's what it would be. Maybe it is just a fruit. Equals up. Oh, heart minus. That is. That. And then that. Plus that. Is that. And then. Wait, I saw that flower symbol before. I spotted it in room G. There is numbers tied to each one of those cells. It probably has something to do with it. Oh, look, a spooky doll. Oh, great. Just an ordinary doll. She just burned it. Why did I do that? A equals 5, B equals 9, D 7, F 4. Ooh wee, that's gonna be a lot of stuff to keep track of. This is referring to the prisoner's rooms. It's not just, just not possible. How can those things be alive, and why are they attacking us? What did I do to deserve this? A locker with several strange symbols. Mm. Looks like you only opened with a four-digit combination. Oh, okay. That's smart. So it, it actually put them up there. So I don't have to, like, backtrack and, like, go, like, well, what was this thing again? I should have wrote this down. Okay. So I know for a fact you were fruit. Okay. Uh, I'll make her accounting in the head of which sim Should I look at this? Probably not. Um, what each symbol was. Now move there. Hey look, evil teddy bear. Cool. Oh? Hmm. Void of this symbol. A rest was made last night in the town community park. A local man in the late thirties was found drinking and insulting several teenagers. The man is currently in police custody. Name Bradford Nathaniel Turner, age 48, prisoner ID 7039. The color of this alcohol bottle seems unusual. 
Red? Huh? Blood? Oh no. A dripping sound. We're about to be spooked and get a heart attack. Oh? There's something up there. Yes. <laughs> this can't be real. I want to go home. The smell of alcohol is unbearable. Hmm. Something's under the bottle. This will be my last bottle. <sighs> We're certainly gonna run out of pills. Like, I know mm. the spook is there, you're not supposed to look at it. But, like, I have to look at it, man. You just can't tempt me like that. So many unusual symbols in this prison. <laughs> what? Well, this is a lot modern. An elevator, hopefully it's still operational. More of these spooky dolls. Bun for the first floor of the factory. Hmm. Hmm. Bun won't respond without a password. <laughs> like an old school prison. Oh, dang, damn it. Force it open the door. <laughs> Trap. That was close. So, if I did the math correct, hmm. it should be 8667. Now, if I'm wrong, great. Okay, I was right. Great! I'll grab my stuff. Tina color code. Oh, never combination. Here we go. Three is red, four is yellow, five is pink, white, cyan, brown, black, two blue. So go with the other one we have, which is make a save. Basically, you're gonna open this gate. So I did put this stuff over here. All right. So the code is green, purple, orange, and white. We know white is one. The ones that are missing are orange, purple, and green. So... We have to use this to figure out what the number is. So like blue and yellow equals green. And the one we need to figure out is purple, which is red plus blue. Red plus blue... Is that is that the correct blue? Because that would make that five. Hmm. Th and then what's orange then? Well, how do we make orange? It's red plus yellow. No, that was the correct blue. So red plus yellow is orange, which would be seven. Be like seven one five, and then we just need to figure out what makes green. I hope I'm doing this right. Blue plus yellow is green. So blue plus yellow would be six. One five. Seven? Six, five, seven, one? I better save before I do this. Well, rip me. Yes. Oh no, I was right. Not bad. Huh? Whose footsteps are these? The footprints lead to my the room on the right. So it could be inside. Wait, 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 I want to go in there. This is such a trap. It's blood and bodies everywhere. You want to follow the footsteps. Hmm. Strange. I don't see anyone here. Nothing interest. I see fireplace. Have expected to get scared by dust. 
Like, whoa, 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 someone's not been up keeping their place! Like, whoa, like a scooby doo shaggy noise. Like, whoa! Just, right now, it's just a lot of blood. This was just an excuse for me to come in here and, like, get upset for a jump scare as I go out, isn't it? That's what you had me do. This is my life. Yep! Oh no! If we weren't having a heart attack before, we're gonna have it now. This can't be real! No! Someone help me! I don't want to die! In a place I before the creatures reach the creatures? What's a good place to clichely hide? The bed? God, this is a terrible hiding spot. Who would ever think to check the bed? Catherine sees the terrifying figures rush into the room. The stench of the blood on their bodies fills the girl with discomfort. Catherine grabs her chest tightly as her fear of death escalates with each passing second. However, the figures lose interest in the search and abandon the room soon after. Damn, it looked like just like it works on the boogeyman. <laughs> the legends are true. If you just hide in the sheets, you're safe from the monsters. But they've finally gone. What happened to this factory? Oh, great. Two whammies. That might have been a heart attack. Huh? No, we're alive. Weird. This place. I'm back. That hangman, was it just a nightmare? No, no. 